What's up, y'all? This is your boy, Big G Principal. And today, I'm here to discuss the Bill Cosby situation. Wow. Wow. And uh, before I even start this off, I want to say uh, we want to send out uh, blessings and, and, and uh, support and love to Mr. Bill Cosby. We want to send those things out. Um, uh, before we go forward, uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Uh, press that like button. Press that bell so you can get some new stuff when I do come out with it. You feel me? Yes, sir. So, let's get into it, man. Let's get into it. So, uh, as you guys know, you know what I'm saying, Bill Cosby uh, was found guilty on all charges of sexual, either was it harassment or abuse, something like that. Uh, sexual harassment or abuse. Um, he was found guilty. And uh, Mesmero come out and said he's not, you know. Uh, but to, you know, start this off, you know, Bill Cosby is a legend, an iconic black figure in the United States of America and around the world, around the globe for that matter, global. And he's recognized for doing so many different things. Um, so Mr. Cosby uh, allegedly assaulted people or drugged them, uh, what they want to say. My thing of it is, is why didn't they come out with this when this shit happened? Didn't this shit happen over 30 years ago? You know what I'm saying? Like, didn't it, didn't it happen over 30 years ago or something like that? It's been a long time since these things took place. You understand what I'm saying? Or allegedly took place. Um, you know, I don't know. I wasn't there, so I don't know what's going on. But I thought usually when, you know, things like that happen that there's... Uh, I guess a time frame on that or something like that. But um, at any rate, you you still don't want things like that to happen. But you start to question whether they really did happen. Like, did that stuff really happen? You understand what I'm saying? Like, really, did that did that stuff really happen? Did it really take place? Because you. you why so many years later? You know what I'm saying? Why so many years later? You know what I mean? And we know that they've been after Mr. Cosby for a while. Okay. It started off with when they, they killed his son. And, uh that stuff because he think he wanted to buy NBC or something like that. He wanted to buy NBC. These are the alleged talking rumors, but what Cosby wanted to do was Cosby wanted to buy those channels or that channel to reprogram the way black people thought and the way that black people were uh, being portrayed uh, in the media and all over their images. And so he wanted to control that. He was very vocal on that, if anybody didn't know. So at a time right now, you know, where we, I mean, that's just, it's like us, what we like to do is our, our heroes, we throw our heroes away and this man is 80 years old. You know what I'm saying? So like, what type of statement are they making? Because he's definitely financially good. He's a billion, billionaire, multi-billionaire. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, he's a multi-billionaire. And um, the only people who could be doing this to him is people that are multi-billionaires like him or trillionaires. You know what I'm saying? Because Bill Cosby knows some shit that we don't know. Definitely does. You know, and what's happening is, is that he's, they know that he knows this stuff. And he has to, you know, he has to either, you know, he got to 
back down from whatever he was trying to do because uh, they then publicly lynched this man. He's lynched. They lynched him. Publicly lynched him, destroyed his whole image. He's guilty, you know what I'm saying, of some crimes that we don't know that really took place, allegedly took place. We don't know what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, Russell Simmons was found guilty. Good thing for that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, uh, uh, not guilty, but innocent. Uh, excuse me. Not guilty, but innocent. Russell Simmons was found innocent. So, uh, you know, we want to uh, congratulate him on that. You know what I'm saying? Our prayers are with you also, Russell. Our prayers are with Mr. Cosby. And uh, we hope these people can get uh, a great resolution to this thing. You know what I'm saying? But look how... He's being portrayed in the media. Look how the media killing him. Look how these white people was killing him and shit. You know what I'm saying? They want that man to spend the rest of his life in prison. For real? For real? You see how they do you? Don't matter how much money you got. Some of you, somebody needs to make a bill. Some man bill. You know? Still, still, a, still a nigga. You know? So Jay-Z and all these puffies and all y'all got that money. Y'all get money now. So, yeah. Be careful. They ready to get niggas. They ready to shut niggas up. Yeah. You better keep your weenie in your pants. And control your sexual appetite. Yeah. Because these people, they, they serious. <laughs> you got white women at the helm of this thing too? Shh. Oh, man. Lynching him. Lynching him for a fact. Lynched. 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 So listen, leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think. You know what I mean? Uh, it's open to dialogue. You know what I mean? Press that like button. Leave a comment. It's your boy, Big G Principal. Uh, press that bell so you can get that so you can get that that notification. Press that bell so you can get that notification. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know, got some new stuff coming up on the channel too, maybe. Be uh, uh, stay tuned for that. You know what I'm saying. Got the interview coming up with Tom Bone Beats, man. That's gonna be dope. You know what I'm saying. Stay tuned for that. You know what I'm saying. Interview definitely coming up, man. Again, press that like button. Uh, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying. Press that bell so you can be notified. You know what I mean. It is what it is. It's your boy.